Well, thank you so much for coming to UC Merced and to help the National Parks Institute. You talked about uh, the proximity of UC Merced to two of our national parks. Can you expand on that a little bit? It's just an exceptional circumstance that a, um, it's research, a, a university that's going to be a research and teaching university of the caliber of UC Merced, and it is destined to grow to a very substantial high level with time. To have that uh, so close to one of the finest national parks in the world, an iconic Yosemite Park in particular. Uh, the opportunities for a partnership between the two and at, in the greater scale between uh, an institution of the high quality and probity of the national park system and of the University of California system. That opportunity is quite extraordinary for uh, the advancement of both research and teaching and in my own field, biology, especially so. You talked about uh, the great challenges that lay ahead in biology, and you talked about the need for us to continue to discover the universe that uh, we haven't gotten to to this point. What are you thinking the role of a research university like UC Merced could be in helping to do that? To continue um, force, forcefully with the all-important task of mapping the diversity of life on the planet. And we know perhaps only 10% of the species to this point um, makes it important that any organization that is able join in. In the case of a university, it has uh, the added value of um, contributing very effectively to the teaching operation as well, because it is in natural, scientific natural history and the exploration of biodiversity, both of which incidentally can and do involve in high technology. This is an exceptionally good way to bring students into science. Thank you very much.